When the university was developing its strategic plan, an obvious opportunity for developing programs was to strengthen our partnership with George Eastman House so that we could uh, mount very distinguished programs that would bring together the humanities and the arts with the sciences and engineering. This is a relationship that's going to take us to places that we haven't been before. It will take us to uh, considerations that we haven't constructed before. It's easy enough to chart the course and to say that we will work together from the humanities to nanotechnology and everything in between. But what I'm looking forward to is working with great minds, both the great minds at the university and the great minds at George Eastman House, and coming out the other side with things that we haven't imagined before. The partnership will enable us to extend the programs that we already offer to undergraduates. It will allow us to offer new courses and programs for graduate students and it will also strengthen the research collaborations that we currently enjoy with George Eastman House. Images provide a very rich source of material for the work of scientists and engineers. They represent challenging scientific and engineering problems in their own right how an image is put together, what the material it's made of. These are, these are all very interesting fundamental problems. But especially nowadays dealing with new media, there are a host of interesting new challenges that we've never faced before. I have talked to the leadership of the American Association of Museums, the Association of Art Museum Directors, and the leadership of the College Art Association. And I've said, does anything with this breadth exist elsewhere? And the answer was, we don't know of anything. I think what you've made is something very, very special and very unique. This is the University of Rochester.